Hey guys, I'm Sean. And I'm Adrian. And we're going to show you guys how to set up a leopard gecko cage. Oh, she's eating. Okay, so we're just going to show you all the basic stuff. Well, all you need right now, you have to get like paper towel and... 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 You you shouldn't use sand for leopard geckos because they could end up getting compacted from the sand and then and they could end up dying. And I've had like a couple like about two of my geckos died of compaction. And yeah. And, and one of my geckos was an adult and it died. And after that, I never tried sand again. Well. I guess I did because my other leopard gecko, Cleo, she's a, uh, an, a, an adult and she almost died because of it. I, I just noticed that her her waist was all sandy and stuff, so I changed that as soon as possible and now she's back to normal. Yeah, and I've, and I've never used sand for her. Well, I have one time, and yeah, but didn't go too well and I've had her for about a year now and okay we'll show you all the stuff now all you need for a substrate would, is like paper towel and try not to use the substrate yeah better beast is good or not okay but there's just use paper towel and or newspaper can, yeah or newspaper and you could get the shedding box and the water dish and then you should have a hide on the on Yeah, the, there's the, the water warm, dish. You should have a hide on the warm side and cool side. Yeah, you should have a hide on the warm side and on the cool side. So and here's the shedding box. Put this in the corner over here. And then there's that. And you and I have this one hide. It's I put it right in between here, so she'll have hide on the hot side, cold side, and warm side. That's what it looks like so far. And then I have a coconut hide. Then here's the coconut hide. Just put this in a corner, and then. And I also have an, one more hiding spot, cork. This is pretty good. You could just set that right in the middle, and they'll be able to crawl under it like this. Hey, you want to go hide? It's okay spot. Here, she doesn't want to hide right now, so. Watch out. And then, that's a, oh, and then, you get your screen top, you can get a foldable one or a sliding one, and I also, I have her live, first of all, you could put, a, leopard gecko could live in a 10 gallon cage its whole life, and I have mine in a 15 gallon, she's gonna stay in here for her whole life, then after the screen top, you could, Get your heat lamp and just put it on. What what do you use? I use a um I use a uh eighty a s wait <laughs> seventy five watt. I use a seventy and I use a seventy five watt purple light. You can the best lights are purple and red. So they can't see it and it doesn't bother them when they sleep. Because remember they're nocturnal. Okay. And they they make great beginner pets and um, they can go good with advanced owners and experienced owners too. Okay, well that's about it. So I'm remember. Sean again and, and I'm Adrian and remember Youth for Oil. Okay, bye. <laughs>